One in five children in the United States is not getting enough food to eat due to the coronavirus outbreak. Russia has recorded over 10,000 cases for five days in a row. All this and more on the Gravitas Coronavirus Tracker. Our study has revealed that nearly one in five children in the United States are not getting enough food to eat due to the coronavirus outbreak. 17% of mothers with children less than 12 years of age reported that their kids were not eating enough because of the lack of money. After recording over 10,000 cases for four days in a row, Russia on Thursday recorded another record jump in the number of cases. 11,231 new cases were recorded in 24 hours, taking the total number of cases in the country to over 177,000. Moscow has imposed new virus restrictions and ramped up testing. Syria has postponed a parliamentary election for a second time in order to contain the spread of the coronavirus. The election schedule for the 20th of May has now been pushed back to the 19th of July. The Syrian government has recorded 44 cases, including three deaths in areas under its control. Six members of the police force in Bangladesh have lost their lives due to COVID-19. Over a thousand are receiving treatment at the Central Police Hospital in Dhaka. Another 1,260 are in quarantine at home and 1,089 are in isolation. The police have promised to pay $12,000 to families of any members who succumb to the disease. Firefighters have designed a disinfection station in northwestern Spain to contain the spread of the coronavirus. The portable station will make it easier for health staff to disinfect their protective equipment by simply standing under the structure. The station is made at a cost of under 300 euros. A team of engineers in Indonesia have produced a compact ventilator in two months, which will be sold at a fraction of the usual cost. The machine is the size of a mini oven and has been assembled using household materials. The team aims to sell the machines for less than $1,000 each, way less than the typical $20,000 to $25,000. Priests in Chile have been holding confession drive throughs outside a Catholic school in Santiago. The priests hear confessions while others wait for their turn in their cars. A new Banksy artwork celebrates the contribution of healthcare workers. The mural by the anonymous artist shows a young boy choosing a nurse as his superhero over the conventional superheroes like Batman and Spider-Man. The painting was unveiled at the University Hospital in Southampton in South England on Wednesday.